Hello everybody, it's Sephiroth 4 for another First Impressions video. Today we're taking a look at Luigi's Mansion 3. What a charming and beautiful looking game. Um, yeah, this was announced a little while back and I got really excited because it's a console version, which means I might actually enjoy it. Now before you start yelling at me, you, no, I didn't really enjoy Dark Moon. There was parts of it that I didn't like and... Maybe we'll talk about it one day, but you know what? Today's not a day to be negative. Let's be positive, and I am positive that I'm gonna like this. I like that it had me select the user in-game. Interesting. Three save files, nice. Okay. But yeah, um... I love Luigi's Mansion, like, absolutely love it. Um, I, I've let's played it twice. <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna let's play Luigi's Mansion too, but again, we're not talking about that today. Toad, you can barely even see- that's not safe. That's not safe at all! Oh my god, look, he's not a good driver! Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Yahoo! Yahoo. Yahoo. <laughs> well, there's, oh, of course, Polter Pup is here. Oh, don't, don't eat the invitation. I think the Luigi's Mansion game should be retitled Mario Falls for Another Real Estate Scam. I can't tell if he like re-recorded those lines or they're just reusing lines from like 3D World. <laughs> Odyssey. That is a nice hotel. I can't believe there's actual story and like cutscenes going into this. This is fancy stuff. Look at them with their with their production value. Oh. Oh. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh yeah, indeed. Well, isn't this fancy? Okay, we can walk around here. Look at Luigi. Look at Luigi just doing his little Luigi shuffle there. Polter pup, go away! Wow, so many presents for us and everything. What was that? Okay. Welcome to the last resort. Wow, home of the most memorable vacations ever had. Welcome to Isle Delfino! Oh man, Mario is just getting ready to dig right in. Okay, how did you eat that? Haha, <laughs> puppy. Can, can this happen again? No. Nope. Listen to that music. Wait, was that only happening near Mario? Yeah, that's cool. Also, can you guys not see that these are just 
ghosts wearing people masks, which is arguably more horrifying than if there were just ghosts here. Look at that! It's like Leatherface or something. Is something the matter? I hope nothing is making your stay here less than perfect. Our entire staff is devoted to providing you with an ideal vacation experience. <laughs> yeah, this is horrifying. That's actually, actually, actually horrifying. I love it. Look at this. Look at this explorable tutorial. Before, not tutorial, before story thing. Toads, how did how did this happen? Yeah, this is their little like music. Ah, Princess Peach definitely didn't forget to pack anything. It's her hi royal highness's matched luggage. <laughs> oh no. Oh, uh, Blue Toad's dead. Good job. Hi. Yeah, there we go. Dun, 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 dun. That's so cool. I love it. It's such a good touch. You just have the little, you know, the music changing depending on who you're standing next to. I don't know if it's going to continue like that in the game with, like, music changing where you are, but at least for this opening, it's so good. This hotel is so big, Luigi. It's gorgeously decorated, too. We're so lucky to have gotten an invitation to come here. <laughs> See you later. Later. Hey, princess. Wow. This hotel is so big. Look at him. Just look at him. Oh, he is so excited. He's so excited to totally not be roped into another adventure. Please make yourself comfortable. Perhaps you'd like to sample our selection of beverages. That is... That is a coffee cup, a pretzel, a cherry, and a sandwich, sir. No, oh, that is... Your... Yeah, but... Man. These are just... Spooky garbage! Ooh. Why do you think of the hotel? We take pride in the luxury and splendor it offers. Do we not notice that he is floating off of the ground? Do we not notice that- oh, maybe he's Rayman. I shouldn't be upset. Maybe he's Rayman. My apologies for the inconvenience, but the elevator is temporarily out of service. We should have it in, have it in tip-top shape soon. I like that Luigi for a moment was just like, actually, Luigi. Every time he gets near these guys, he gets look at the look at his face. He knows something. Oh my god, he actually knows something is up. Good job, game. See now he's back to normal, but around these guys, he's the only one here that suspects something. Man, why does no one pay attention to Luigi? It looks like you haven't checked in yet. Please make your way to the front desk. It's right over there. Everyone should just listen to Luigi. Okay, this one doesn't look like he's trying hard enough. Welcome, guests, to the last resort. Are you ready to check in? Yeah, sure. Thank you. Is this like a roach motel? We check in, but we don't check out? Well, guests, welcome to the last resort. Name is My name is Helen Gravely, and I am the owner of this hotel. I am absolutely delighted that you decided to accept my invitation. That is a hairstyle. You must all be very tired. Come, allow me to show you to your room. Oh, no need to worry about your luggage. Our exceptional staff will take care of it for you. That guy's horrifying. Oh, it was a mask. Okay. Yeah. 
your VIPs after all. Okay, the way she's doing this is just reminding me of like every single Phoenix Wright character who just like, you know, when you're interrogating them has that like whatever nervous tick that they have. No, and then they just keep no, doing it. We've prepared a first-rate experience for you. All the trappings of luxury. Shall we get going? Do you guys not see that something's up? Uh, look at that little smirk there. I saw that. What, no 13th floor? I like the little uh, window on her chest is like a gem shape. Mario, Luigi, and Peach's rooms are over here. We've prepared rooms for you toads as well. I hope you enjoy your stay. I dare say you'll remember it for the rest of your lives. Yeah, see you later. Bye. Bye. Night, night. Night, night. Okay, this game looks beautiful, by the way. Like, absolutely beautiful. I'm so happy that they didn't make it, uh, like, try to shove it onto the 3DS again. Because it really shows just how much they were able to improve it from Dark Moon. Man, look, everything is gold in here. It's beautiful. Oh, look at this. We got a toilet. Wow. I like that he has to climb up to use the sink. What is he Five? Oh, yeah. oh you can pet the puppy! Okay, very nice, very nice. Wow, look at this place. Ah! They have to scare me like that. Mario! 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 Oh, by the way, if I can settings, cool. Uh, let's check out the settings for a second. Controls. Skip, pause menu, action, turn, move. Movement while poltergusting. Spoilers, we're gonna have poltergusting. Adjust brightness, I think we're good with that. Guide? That's cool. <clears throat> One day, Luigi received a letter. The letter was sent by Helen Gravely, the owner of a big hotel up in the mountains. When Luigi opened it, he discovered that it was a special invitation. Congratulations, Luigi. You're the lucky winner of a free stay at the world-class hotel, The Last Resort. We look forward to dazzling you with first-rate hospitality and service. Please be sure to invite any friends or family that you'd like to bring as well, Helen Gravely. Luigi was overcome with excitement at the letter and rushed to invite his big brother Mario, as well as Princess Peach and a trio of toads. Soon, they all departed for the hotel. Upon arriving at the beautiful hotel, Luigi and his friends were warmly welcomed by Helen Gravely herself. Afterward, they were each shown to their rooms. Bum, bum. Um, very cool. And there's other stuff there. I don't want to look at it right now. There. Ah. Okay. Open our suitcase. Time to rest. Sure. Yeah. So what did you pack? See, Luigi even packed, like, the flashlight for the poltergust, because he knows better at this point. Either that or he's really scared of the dark. <laughs> uh, 
Game theory. Luigi is the smartest Mario brother. There's the spooky ambiance. Oh my god, that's not what this place looked like. Okay, so let's see, the right stick. Hmm. Uh, you know what? I'm going to see if I can change that. No? Gyro sensitive? Oh, whatever. It's like when you press right. Okay, I'm just gonna have to get used to this. So this this goes up and down when you press up and down. So that's like I'm holding up, and I'm looking up, uh, but pressing right makes him turn clockwise. Pressing left makes him turn counterclockwise. I just have to get used to that. There's no Mario button, which is still a shame. Oh, and now things are just scaring me. Good. Wow, the, everything here is not good. Go away. Oh, hi, money. Hello. So what's in here? More scares? More scares, yeah. Figured. Uh, let's go check out the bathroom. I love how Luigi just like stays scared for a few seconds. It's great. It's the little things, you know? Okay, so that's pulled back, which means that there's obviously going to be something hiding behind there. Can you stop giving me Bowser Claws? I don't know what that's doing. Oh, I, I see that up there. Hi. Look at those gold bars up there. I want. No, nothing really? Okay. I guess let's try to leave. But yeah, let's remember that there was gold there. I can't believe it was all an illusion. Oh boy. Maybe the illusion just fades at night? Dum, 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 dum. Paul! No, my hat! Okay, so holding B kind of seems to make you run or hold position or something. Okay, everything here looks really nice. Look at this. It's fancy. Ugh! Ugh! I don't need spiders. Oh, Mario, you alright? Okay, Mario, what did you do here? Look at all this pizza. Mario, you are very unclean. Do you know that? Why do I have to be not only the the smartest Mario brother, but also the most hygienic? And currently the richest. Achoo! Do you have a bathroom? You do not have a bathroom that is accessible. Okay, so Mario's gone. Good, good. Man, I like how movable everything is. Also, there's a... No, I don't want to go in. Okay, that door has a huge hitbox, and there's like a mouse hole. Or I guess in this case it was a spider hole. I don't want to ever say that again. Okay, who's this? This is Peach, right? 
Yeah, this was Peach's room. Doesn't look like she even used her bed. She's leaving her skulls everywhere. Princesses, am I right? Oh, oh look at that, it's adorable. Okay. And her bag just popped. Oh no, her bag did not pop. Her bag indeed just went out of existence. So that's cool. Or clipped into a thing. So that, that's cool. She just has a whole... Oh god. Whole thing of that. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Let's take some of Peach's money. I like the physics engine here though. Anything outside? <laughs> I just love how Luigi reacts to things. He's like, okay, I'm done over here. That's great. Oh. <laughs> the elevator opens up, it's uh, David Pumpkins. I'm David Pumpkins! And I'm here to scare the hell out of you. Well, well, well. If it isn't my most esteemed VIP, I was just on my way to see you. Is your room living up to expectations? Doesn't it scream good taste? No. Oh. I can barely contain myself. You have no idea how much I wanted you to accept my invitation. Why is that? I'm sure you're wondering. <laughs> you see, there's someone I truly adore. He's the inspiration for some of my greatest ideas, like inviting you here. I'm such a huge fan of his. That's why it's so wonderful I get to introduce him to you. That's right, Luigi. I hope you're ready. Is her boyfriend King Boo? Yay! <laughs> Surprise, Luigi! It's a me, King Boo. That old coot had me locked up tight in his lab. But guess what? I got out! The hotel owner here was just dying to meet me, so she busted me out. Pretty lucky, huh? Anyway, I didn't think you'd actually show up here. I was ready, though, just in case. In fact, my vengeance is nearly complete. What do I mean by vengeance? Glad you asked! I'm trapping you and everyone in your little vacation party in frames! Aw, oh, there, there, Luigi. It'll be all be over soon. It's time for a family reunion! Booyah! Oh man, it's remember when that happened in the first game? I, I don't know. I don't. What we? Oh, she just ripped our invitation apart. That's rude. <laughs> Take that. Oh, and there's one more frame. Of course, I saved it especially for you. Stay right there and put on your best terrified face, Luigi. This is game over. Uh uh. Mm-mm. Uh-uh. Mm-mm, mm-mm. Uh-uh. Oh, boy. Uh-uh. Mm-mm. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Mm-mm. Oh, this is like that one really rigged, um, Mario Party, uh, uh, level. Uh, a minigame. You know, the one where the giant boo chases you? You know, you know, the one where you stop even for one second and he gets you? Well, we died. Luigi's Mansion 3, the actual scene. A. Look at that. Dune. Ah, oh, it's the logo and everything. Dune. I really hope it gets at least close to the music from the first game because I was very disappointed with the second game. Music wise. Polter Pop. <laughs> 
Papi. He's going to Papi. Oh, he's adorable. I wish I could adopt him. Look at him. Look at him with his cap and his his overalls. Where are we at for time? Oh, we're almost at 30 minutes. That's too bad. Let's at least get the poltergust. Oh, that just went out. So there's a whole bunch of stuff here that it kind of looks like that we can use. Oh, money. Ooh, piece of candy. Ooh, piece of candy. Ooh, bubbles. Do, 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 do. It's definitely like, just look how good it looks. <laughs> look how scared he gets of everything. It's adorable. Look at that, just ah! I love it. That is, oh. No, I want it, I want it, I want it. I want that gem. Aha. I like that the game encourages you to move things. That's good. Thanks, Poltapop. And other things just vomit at you. That's snaky. This thing is is just the cutest. Garage, let's get out of here, Polter Pop. First, I just want to see what's over here. Stuff to vacuum up. Rats. The electrical system. Mo oh my god, that's a lot of money. Jeez. And a gold bar. We'll get that whenever we can vacuum things up. Slip? No, we can't slip and slide on this banana peel. Do 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 do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know you're in there. You're gonna pop out and scare me. Just like in the game. Or the last game. It's bothering me that Luigi only has 99 health as a max. I can't that what is that doing in there? What why was that in there? I like that it had a suiting up cutscene. Oh, Luigi's so excited. Okay, let's practice some polter pop. Oh wait, are we actually gonna practice? Oh, yeah, we're actually gonna practice some polter pop. That's not nice. Okay, so, so just like, oh boy, so just like uh, uh, the last game, you can charge up your charge up your flashlight. Oh wow! Okay, so ZR is suck in, ZL is blow out, and the two of them together is like ground pound. Oof! Comfortable with what you learned? Sure. Why was it just in the car there, though? Polterpup, how did you know? Bye. Well, there goes our friend. Alright, so let's... Our first task here is just cleaning up in general. Because as you all know, it's important to... Oh my god, it's important to just clean everything. Everything we see. That's interesting. Is that... Yeah, okay, that's something that you have to flash at, which is something I don't want to say ever again. Also good, it's the thing where it has all the gems from the last game, which I hated. Good. 
Good. Can I have this? No. Maybe later. That's cool. Wait. I saw some money there. They made the uh, folder gust a lot more quiet in this version of the game. I guess people were complaining about that. So these holes seem to be places where you can just suck money out of. Now I refuse to amend my speech in any way, shape, or form, but thank you for asking. Excuse you, sir. Mm -hmm. It's not gonna last. <laughs> Okay, that. Get some money off the shelf here. Wow, we, we, we got a nice amount of money already, that's cool. So what does it want from us there? Can we do anything here just yet? Doesn't look like it. Hmm. Well, let's try leaving. Yeah, that, I guess that's that's an exit. We can't really exit. Let's go back this way though. Um, so yeah, the controls seem pretty good so far. I'm just gonna have to get used to the up down. Let's just, let's eat everything. There's money up there. Let's just, let's just eat every, literally every. Okay, so sometimes it seems that the stuff, the random junk on the floor turns into money when you suck it up. Because it gets shredded. Interesting. Excuse me. Okay, so the gyroscope on the controller also works with up and down. Like I'm swinging the controller around there, so I'm just gonna have to remember that. So I don't screw myself up. <laughs> Still don't know how to get this yet, but we'll figure it out. Can I, can I just unplug it? No, of course not. That, that would be too easy. Oh, maybe this. Oh, nope. That's just making a valve full of coins. That's not how that works. Let's go around here. Or, or that. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, they just left money laying around here all over the place. But, like, you see what I mean um, about the music? Like, right now, the music is very, very light. That's pretty much how, at least from my experience, like, what I remember 90% of the last game being. Because, you know, it's there's so much backtracking in order to get you know, all the you know, various gems and stuff. And uh, it just made it feel to me like the game was completely just empty. I hated it. So, yeah. I, I don't like how low the music is. And if I just turn up the game, then the sound effects are going to be way too loud. We're going to have to use that, uh, that other thing on... Uh, the... From the last game. There's a thing from the last game that, that affects that. Okay. 
Okay. All right. Calm down. Calm down. This is a money tree right here. Okay, cool. Actual money. Come on. I'm destroying this poor plant. I feel like a terrible human being. Why did they even install one of these doors? Unless this is like Egad's lab or something. It was just security controlled. Haha, oh, yeah. <laughs> Luigi's so happy with himself. Snack, please? Nope, just just money. I wanted a snack, but alright. Oh, it is shooting out snacks also. It's shooting out both. That's not how that's supposed to work, but thank you for the donuts. So are, are all the fire extinguishers going to do that? Because that's not up to code. That's very uh, unsafe. And I want to talk to a manager. Money! Lots of money. Right. I have no idea what that was. Is that pearl? Probably. Come on, give us a ghost. Just give us a ghost. One ghost. Singular El Ghostero Uno. I apologize to anyone who speaks Spanish for me just misusing the language like that. There we go. There we go. Okay, so you gotta blow that up. How the heck? Okay, I need to like ground pound on that or something. Popper. Okay, we're on another floor, so that's good. Okay, we are just trashing this place, but I guess I guess they deserve it? Question mark. Or is this our floor? This might be our floor. Yeah, this is floor one. Don't need fire for that, probably. Oh, 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 this is the lobby, okay. Hi, Danganronpa. Hopefully we get some truth bullets out of this. Terrible carpenter! Don't, don't you scoot! Don't scoot! Yeah. Play dead! Oh. I know what I'm doing. Oh, oh, I see. I see. Okay, so you gotta do the thing like from the first game there and it charges up that meter. Got it, got it. That makes more sense. I like that it meshes the two gameplay because I did not like the ghost catching mechanic from the last game. Surprise, I, I don't know. I feel bad. I feel bad that I didn't enjoy the last game as much as some other people did. Like, I- I don't know. Sometimes I feel like I'm, I was too critical on it. But... Then I look at it again, or I try to play it again, and I'm like, no. No, I still feel the same way now. 
or I watch other people play it and I'm like, nope, nope, they're having fun and I still don't like it. And I'm sorry. Don't let my lack of enjoyment of a game ever hamper your enjoyment of it. Like, never ever let that... I know it's it's really easy to let other people's opinions sway you, but like, if you enjoyed Dark Moon, I'm so happy, like super happy, because it's Luigi's Mansion at the end of the day, and that's cool. That's fun. Why are there so many little pumpkins? Hello? Wrong number. Hello? Hey, money! Why didn't you give me money before? Kaboom, baby! I really love this, uh... I really love this, uh... Hopper, don't go to the... Oh, I thought, I thought he was lifting his leg up. That was his tail. Sorry, Pupper. Just erase any record that we were even here. There we go, beautiful. Hello, key. Okay, I really need to, um... I really need to stop playing this because it's been 40 minutes, but anyway. Uh, so far I'm enjoying this. I'm slightly wary of some of the mechanics that are returning from Dark Moon, but they've also meshed it with mechanics from the first game, so who knows? Oh my god, oh my god. Wow, we are stealing so much. Okay, so there's several types of gems to collect. We have already made $2,600. Uh, that's going to do it for the first impression. So, so far I'm enjoying this. I'm just going to turn the music up for one moment. Okay, so it's really, really, really low in the background. I don't think I can change that. Guide settings... No, it's just adjust brightness. Ah, that's annoying. So, I'm just going to play it louder on my own time, I think. And uh, hopefully that will make the problems, or the problem that I have anyway with the sound, uh, a little better. But anyway, that's that's it. <laughs> Thank you very much for watching. Uh, I'm looking forward to, uh, to playing more of this, and that is another gem. Can I even get that? Come on. I'm wondering, like, what are what am I gonna get that's gonna be like super power, you know, to get it or something? Anyway, uh, yeah, uh, I recommend this so far. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye, everybody. Bye bye.